What's up YouTube? It's your boy Kevin Kraft and Daryl Horner checking back in with you. I recently did a video talking about Sarah Palin and I got a lot of hate mail. People telling me they're going to kill me. I'm racist and everything in that nature. I really don't give a fuck. But Daryl brought to my attention that, you know, Barack Obama, Joe Biden, Sarah Palin, and McCain got some shit in common. All of them. What's up Verbally Vicious Nation? You know when I show up on Kevin's page, shit's going to get hot. <laughs> so... What I'm here to say, though, is that I jumped down Kevin's shit. Because we ain't put... Look, I, Kevin talks about he is hate mail. I'm the sellout wigger. I'm the race trader. So I don't want to... When he does some shit on Verbally Vicious Nation, he's rocking that logo. I, I can't let him away with that shit. So I had to explain to him that they got a lot of stuff in common. And he doesn't understand that they have a lot of stuff in common. Like, Kevin, I bet that you didn't know that as a child, Barack Obama met Martin Luther King Jr. I also know that McCain voted against Martin Luther King Day numerous of times. So see, they, they got that in common. They do. They have that in common. Well, I know Barack Obama is a big porter, supporter of fucking um, Black History Month. That's true. He is. And John McCain, uh, if he had it his way, black people would simply be a part of history. <laughs> McCain, I got something for you, man. Get over it because this shit's not going to happen. I'm like Sarah Palin. I'm going to keep popping these kids out. Every time I see a welfare family with like nine kids picking up food stamps, I'm going to be like, oh, they're pulling a Palin. Because <laughs> she got babies like crazy. Like crazy. She got babies with babies. Oh, she got babies with Babies making babies. Isn't there a song, some country shit, by that Toby Keith motherfucker with them big dick sucking lips? Where were you in the tower? Sorry, I'm getting off track, bitches. I get fired up when I hear the stupid shit that people put on Kevin's page. But Kevin does need to understand there are similarities. Listen, people, Sarah Palin's husband once got a DWI. And um, Joe Biden's wife was killed by somebody with a DWI. Damn. It's like their family. You know, like the fact that Sarah Palin has a daughter who's not married and is knocked up by a kid that's over age. Now, and they say black people do that. So exactly. They got, they got that in common. That's cool. Exactly. Uh, they say black people sell a lot of crack, and in Sarah Palin's hometown of 7,000 people, 49 meth labs. 49 meth. That's at you, least 49 you, you, you trailers. You can tell me she wasn't using meth. You can tell me. Well, she Look seems to still have talk. her teeth, though. Well, yeah. you know, she's rich now, so she'll be honest with that. You want some teeth? I can get you some teeth. That's true. You can get you We'll sell you some teeth, I'll man. I'll you fucking Charlie Murphy teeth. Kevin, I, I know people today. who can fucking get you anything you want. Here's what I love. They say that Joe Biden is well-versed in foreign policy, and just the other day, Sarah Palin learned how to spell <laughs> foreign policy. Are you telling me she wasn't this special ed hooked on phonics? You trying to tell me that? Dude, she went to community college. Barack Obama graduated with a scholarship from an Ivy League university. She went to community college. Not even community college in, like, California. The bitch went to community college in Alaska. Three t three times? Three different community three colleges. Three different, our director's saying three different, three? How the wow. fuck you get booted from community college in Alaska? You know class is like, does a bear shit in the woods 101. How the fuck do you fail that shit? Apparently she did fail. How to tell there's 49 meth labs in your hometown. She must have failed. Michael, now here's another thing that they, people got in common. Barack Obama, almost completely black. Michael Vick, very black. Michael Vick is in jail for fighting dogs and killing dogs. And Sarah Palin sits in a helicopter and shoots moose with her high-powered rifle. Mooses! Mooses. Shoots mooses! And brags about it. Look at me, shot a moose. She shot ridiculous. more moose. She shot more moose than she met McCain. Oh, yeah. It's, it, they're, they're fucking crazy. We already have a vice president that says he hunts and then shoots people in the fucking face. You want Palin pulling that shit? It is ridiculous. This country's going to war. Now, here's what I love. Somebody brought something up a few minutes ago. Sarah Palin's like, I know about foreign di 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 diplomacy because I wake up every day and look out of my backyard at Russia to make sure they're not invading. Listen. As bad as Russia may be, do you really think somebody wants to escape that bitch and come to Alaska? Hell no. But you know what pisses me off, Daryl? It makes me so mad, man. Orange juice is $10 in Alaska. No, fuck that, man. It just makes me mad to know that 
McCain, they, you said McCain met her twice, right? Twice. 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 I had. I go, met my weed dealer more times than I that before I trusted his ass. I had to go on four fucking job interviews at Red Lobster to get the job to see people. That's some bullshit For right the there, seafood man. lover in you. That's, that's what he went and did. This shit is ridiculous. That's why I do comedy. He, look, here's a simple shit. fact. Uh, people talk about that they're mavericks. And that they're making a change. And I'd love to. She's a soccer mom. I've met soccer moms. I would not trust nuclear codes of one of them ever. They named, Did you see the name of her kids? Like Tegan, Tyler, uh, Metal Stick, fucking Hockey Puck. I don't even know what the fuck those kids' names are. But this is the kind of family who said Jesus helped Trevor score a goal today. Oh, you know, my son wouldn't have won his eight-year-old soccer game if it wasn't for Jesus. This woman says that God wants them in the election. If I see that God endorsed them, they have to quit running because we have separation of church and state. Plus, God needs to put the fucking sherm down if he really wants them bitches. Here's why he wants uh, McCain to be president, because the bitch is almost dead anyway. And then he'll have the qualifications, and he can uh, go help him run heaven. I don't know. So with Possibly. that said... What that say? To all my YouTube subscribers. Word up. Come check out my page. Check Love. out Daryl Horner's page if you mm -hmm. want facts. I did you guys a big favor. People said I'm not spitting facts. We do our homework before we do these videos, okay? Facts. So please don't Her make yourself look 16. stupid on the comments, Her man. Her daughter was 16. The Fuck boy was 18. That shit is a criminal offense in 38 Come states. Come up here. They, he would have been in jail, the guy she was having If it was Barack Obama's 16-year-old oh, daughter, it would have been, look at those N-words. Oh Just humping, God. humping, humping. Oh, my gosh, man. Anyways... Do me a favor. She fired everybody in her hometown when she got elected mayor and, and would not let them have their job back unless they stood. This bitch talking about bipartisan? She's closer to bisexual than she is bipartisan. She's if bipolar. You on, she's bi definitely bipolar. <laughs> but don't say big words like bipolar because then she'll have to pull out a fucking dictionary and map quest that shit. But anyways, YouTube, subscribe to my page, Daryl Horner's page. Rate this video and comment and let us know what you think. You know, with that said, we out of here. Love, peace, and hair grease, motherfuckers!